Hello friends. Today we will learn how to make an apple catching game. On my screen you can see the game. Today we will learn to make it. So let's begin with it. So for making an apple catching game, I'll require three sprites. One is ball. Then I'll require an apple, and I'll require one more sprite that is a line. I don't require the sprite one, so I'll delete it. I'll also take one backdrop, blue sky, so that it will look beautiful. So for ball, I'll take. When green flag clicked, set x to zero, and I'll take set y to minus one thirty five. So it will go in this at this position. Then I'll make a block called. Moving ball, then I'll take if then from control, I'll take key pressed from sensing, then I'll take if key right arrow pressed, then I'll take move ten steps. Again, I'll take if then from control. I'll take key left arrow press then move minus ten steps. I want this procedure to repeat again and again, so I'll take this block moving ball here. And also here. So when I click on green flag, and if I click on the right arrow, it will go on the right side. And if I click on the left arrow, it will go on the left side. So this is how it will move. So for ball, ah, code tower. For apple, I'll take when green flag clicked. I'll take go to random position. Then I'll take set y to one seventy. Then I'll make a block called falling apple. Then I'll take. Change y by minus six point five. Then I'll take if then from control. I'll take touching from sensing. I'll take if touching ball. Then I'll take go to random position. I'll take set y to one seventy, and then I'll make one variable called score because I want the score to be counted whenever I catch a catch an apple. Then I'll take change. Score by one, here. Yeah. Then I'll take if then from control. I'll take if touching line. 
then i'll take say game over for 2 seconds then i'll take stop all from control i want this process procedure to repeat again and again so i'll take falling apple from here and i'll attach it here i'll take set score to zero here so that when i click on the green flag the score will autom- automatically become zero because i want that zero whenever i start the game i'll uh, put it in the center so that it will look correctly then i'll take falling apple here a code for apple are also over but the apple look so big it is bigger than the ball so i'll reduce its size to 70 now it will look smaller one for line i'll take when green flag clicked set x to 0 and i'll take set y to minus 180 a game is ready let's check it if it is working or not so i'll click on the green flag yes it's working and the score is also changing while i play this game please like my video and subscribe my channel and if the apple falls on the line it says game over and the game is stopped and you can see the final score here so this game is working properly please like and subscribe thank you for watching my video